Yeah, what's up, family? Ever since he stepped in the boo-boo and made anti-Semitic remarks, Kanye West has been losing business deals and associates left and right, even worse. Some are reporting that he may no longer be able to call himself a billionaire, something that hurts him dearly. Let me tell you something, fam. I don't pocket watch, so I don't give a damn how much money Kanye West is worth. Especially if he ain't doing nothing for the people with it. Now, I just like the idea that he's in pain. That's it. What do they say? An enemy of my enemy is a friend of mine. Something like that. Here's a list of some of the companies that have severed ties with Kanye West. Starting with CAA, the talent agency. Yeah, he makes them a lot of money. We're talking millions and millions a year. Cut them off. Balenciaga. Last week, the fashion house cut ties with him. J.P. Morgan Chase. Cut ties with him. We don't want your money. Take it somewhere else. Ah, oh, yeah. See, that's when you know it get real right there, fam. When they don't want the money. Vogue. Cut them off. Cut them off. We don't need your so-called sense of fashion instincts. Cut them off. And then the gap. Cut them off. Cut him off. Finally, there's his prized partnership, or should I say former prized partnership with Adidas. This guy basically dared Adidas to drop him, and they did. I guess he thought that because he helped them make $1.7 billion last year, that that was enough leverage for him to just say whatever he wanted to say. Remember about a month or so ago, he called out one of their senior executives, telling Adidas, hey, it's either him or me. Like One of us got to go. Looks like Adidas made their decision. And I will say the right decision. Now you have those out there who once again are talking about how much of a genius this guy is. Even though he blew potential billions of dollars. Uh, he's still a genius because he's Kanye. So whatever he does, they figure out a way to reverse it and, and put it into his genius bag. It's just genius. It's genius. Kanye ain't that smart. He's just not that smart. All of those brands that dropped him, he knew what he was up against, but he, remember, this is the guy called himself Jesus, and he think he Jesus. Uh, so this guy, he thinks that he's some type of God. And I do believe that Kanye has basically violated the cardinal sin of celebrity. Believing in your own press clippings. One of the first things that I learned when I got into this business is to not believe my own press clippings. Whether they were good or bad, stay even. People praise you, give you all this praise. Hey, thank you, thank you. Keep it moving. People try to disparage you. Uh, whatever, whatever. Keep it moving. Like, don't get too down, don't get too high. Now, here's the thing, fam, about these companies. I'm not crazy about any of these companies because where were these companies in 2005 when Kanye West said, George Bush don't like black people. They were still right there with him. Where were these companies? And obviously not all of them were doing business with him at that time, but you catch my drift, fam. You know, 
many of these companies didn't start distancing themselves until he made the anti-Semitic remarks, right? Where were they in 2009 when Kanye crashed the stage at the VMAs and interrupted, well, hijacked Taylor Swift's acceptance speech? Beyonce had a better record than you. Remember that? Where were they when he was threatening Pete Davidson's life? It's a white dude. They were still with him. Where was this dude when he was talking all this white lives matter stuff and slavery was a choice? I don't respect none of them. None of them. But I'm glad that they hitting the enemy in the pocket. I appreciate that. So I won't get on them too much right now. But I just appreciate it. Anybody that can cause him distress, any kind of pain, I'm with him. I'm down. I'm all the way down. I'm down. Now, some of y'all saying, Willie, that's cynical, man. Willie, that's cynical, Willie D, man. You, man, you define God, man. You define God. Why well, I got to find God? Y'all already know where he is. Just point me in the direction. I go right there. And I can save some time. Kanye West is crying right now, fam. He's crying in the car because he find his importance in money. Remember when he said he wasn't going to let anybody come between him and his money? He was talking about Puffy. Won't let nothing come between me and my money. Nothing. He want that billionaire status so bad that he sold his soul, fam. And I do believe that he gave up some other stuff for that bread. I think, you know. Yeah, fam. Yeah, man. I think you've done something of that because you got to be on that type of level to throw your own people under the bus. I think if you throw your own people under the bus, that's intrinsically who you are. You throw your own people under the bus, sold for sale, man. I think you'll do anything. I think you're capable of anything. That's a person I would absolutely not trust. Yeah, he thought he was Jay. He wasn't black. He was Kanye. Well, he changed his name to Ye now. He ain't black, he yay. Or so he thought. Say it with me, fam. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? <laughs>